going on everyone and welcome back to the channel guys i know in the last video i said i was going to be getting a baseline for my car in the next video that's actually probably going to be in the next video i had a few things come up but anyway guys right now we've got the gt500 in here now if you watched my videos you've seen that right there that is actually this car come all the way down from chicago matt over there sublime gt500 but came all the way down from Chicago, and uh, we did a few things at the dealership. I actually replaced his uh, filter, trans filter he's got to do every 20,000 miles. We got that replaced. And then we also uh, did a recall on it. But, however, now it's here, and we are going to install a ZPE Grip Tech pulley and hub assembly. Now, we are going with the 2.85 pulley, which gives them... Brought at 14 pounds of boost. So going with that, and he's also going to be getting a Wingard Performance Tune put in. So we're going to be doing that. We're going to go ahead and get everything started. The reason I removed the front bumper, now you can do this without removing the front bumper. However, uh, he's also getting some, what brand? Those are right there, the Ops. Oh, the Op 7 lighting, turn signal, mark, parking lights, LED, LED sequentials. I'll, I'll unbox that later. But uh, he's getting these right here, guys. And so I figured since we got to drain the coolant and everything to get uh, the pulley and everything off, I figured we got to do the lighting anyway. Might as well go ahead and pull the front, whole front bumper off. So we went ahead and did that. And then he had a bunch of uh, pebbles and stuff right here. I told him to stop driving down on gravel roads. But you say it's car mob's it's fault? Car mob. Anyway. <laughs> car mob. Car mob, he's throwing you under the bus, bud. <laughs> but uh, anyway, so what we're going to do, guys, is we're pretty much going to be installing the uh pulley hub from uh zpe grip tech pulley uh, putting a green belt on changing out his spark plugs so and right getting here? a tune from winger performance so, so what's what that this feels an impact i was asking him where no, the no, airbag the, sensors that's are. them right here that's, those. that's these things yeah i was like I should, I should have him hold this socket when you say it's sublime's car it's the 10 millimeter oh <laughs> uh, we're not going there <laughs> All right, guys, so uh, another thing that you want to order if you're doing this by yourself at home, if you take it to a shop, uh, a lot of shops will buy this piece, especially if you're working on GT500s. This is actually from a ZPE uh, Grip Tech, and it is a tool. And as you can see, this right here sits down in there. So you'll take that off when you pull it out, and then these three prongs will set right down into this tool. Hold on a second. Like that. And then you'll put this right here in a vise, and they also send the correct, uh, with the tool, they send the correct Allen bit. It's a 17 millimeter if you don't know, if you need one, but if you buy the tool, it comes with it. But anyway, so you'll do this, put this in here, and then you'll just use an impact, pop this off, and then you'll go back with the Grip Tech hub.
right, so we got the ZPE hub put on with the 2.85 grip tech pulley with the green bag belt, got the coolant back in, got the spark plugs replaced, and we got the tune loaded in from Winger Performance. Did our initial data log. Once it gets back with us, we'll go ahead and do the driving log, and then once we're ready to go wide open throttle, we will put it on the dyno and finish the tuning on the dyno. We also got the OP7 turn signals put in. When you seen the first startup video, we were testing that out, so you was able to see that. Uh, but guys, also want to talk to you about, um, you can pick up all this stuff from us. We are a dealer for all of this and much more. We're on the, uh, guys, this wind is horrible out here, as you can hear. Um, but um, we're a dealer for pretty much anything. We can get you pretty much anything. We are in the process of getting the website built, uh, hprautomotive.com. We're in the process of doing all that. Um, but anyway, if you don't see parts on there, which right now is very slim, but we can get you pretty much anything, hit us up. Uh, you can do, use the contact us on there, or you can contact us at sales at hprautomotive.com. But anyway, guys, we're going to go ahead and next time you see this, we'll be on the dyno, ready to give it a rip on the dyno and finish the tuning on the dyno. So we'll see you then.